Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome to Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Subscribe to the channel, follow us on Twitter, it's a P Miller ENT. We're on Instagram, it's Miller Entertainment. Welcome to another edition of our daily news on breaking news. So, uh, as you all know, guys, that uh, SB Moyo passed away uh, yesterday. The man was a uh, foreign affairs minister, and uh, may he so rest in peace. We send condolences to the family and the loved ones. But but there's a picture which is circulating on social media. I mean, it's a nice house, it's a mansion. And uh, as all know, uh, uh, his wife, uh, you know, and do chairman with Zach. And the chairman with Zach and do um, it's my SB Moyo. So financially, uh, they could afford that kind of a house. In Yangundo Monerango, that's how I viewed. But many people on social media are now circulating and saying, Ayo. Nimbei yaka wakwa ni ma Chinese and the ezo no kuti tarazons wa muga be kuti ayo ma Chinese ndo waka waka imbaya the the blue roof here you know uh, it was something that was uh, a secret apana yambo zero but tarazons zero muga be asha so people are saying kuti uh, that the house was built by uh, the friends from the east and uh, which are Chinese and uh, so guys uh, I don't know kuti chokwa di dan kunyepa but the house looks so beautiful it looks nice sika zang panya kala but the color quantity is not nice but uh, I, I didn't get again a full view picture of the house but as far as I can see those are pictures which are on on your screen right now I could tell you that the house looks good it looks nice the man was rumored to be moving uh, into this new house uh, this week but as one of the Mariva of Amtora and so guys uh, let's talk in the comment section one hour I mean, they are the ministers, uh, all the top government officials, those guys are, are living the life. Are living the life in one of the which are referring to Zimbabwe. Those guys are the ones who are actually enjoying staying in Zimbabwe. But the rest of the people are suffering. They are the majority, which is the most population, uh, you know, are high density suburbs who are overpopulated. They, uh, people are suffering, you know, and uh, at the same time, COVID 19, you know, you know, but these guys are actually enjoying, uh, you know, the fruits. I mean, they deserve this, and deserve but as far as I am concerned, Zimbabwe belongs to everybody, it belongs to Kogwangwa, Rukamurewa, Na Komawangwa, Arukum Fakosi, also to a part of this you know receiving the end of our zimbabwe and we can all benefit but only a few people are benefiting out of this so get in the comment section when i say in bayawa is be more and many people are saying good yeah china but to me i still feel good i mean uh can i Kazari judge uh, the man is the foreign affairs minister. I mean, on my business, is of course, he's a retired uh, major general, local army. I mean, big reasoning, big nigger. Those guys are not just ordinary uh, persons like me and you. Those guys are my connection, uh, not just here in Zimbabwe, but all over. Saga, in Berada, so one didn't need an item on the Shamis. I still feel good. But I know what to need to win Zimba. Remember, I said for a Zimbazo, Wombere, Rachkisa, Chkisa. You know, I've seen it many, uh, many times on social media, reached out 10 years ago, but no one can buy that house. I mean, uh, you know, price tag was about uh, 1.2 million US dollars. Who, who, who could buy that house? In Zimbabwe, you can end up walking to a hotel, can walk to a crash, can a college, and just to get your money back. The morning round, guys. Let's talk in the comment section. Our daily news on breaking news. We send condolence messages to, uh, to SB Moyo's family and the loved ones. And uh, may you so rest in peace. Thank you very much for listening and watching. Bless up.